could say I like records. Okay, I love records. So I was pretty excited about this new record cutting service right here in Sanford. So the people that collect records are the people who really love music. And Rob loves music. He and his wife Kendra operate Rabbit Foot, a record shop and cafe in downtown Sanford. We started in Titusville back in 2012. Started a little, just dusty little record store, you know. I used to be in a lot of like bands and it was always, you know, I wanted to have my music out on a, on a record. I just thought that would be super cool. Rob traveled to Germany to learn how to cut the records from the man who makes the machines. Cue up the music. I just thought it'd be kind of a cool business model to have a record store that was like, I guess, turnkey, you know, where you could go in and you could look for records, but have a record made if you want it or something like that. I mean, there's very few people that do this in the world, you know? Um, in the United States, there's only a couple, one or two in Europe, uh, maybe one in Japan. I, I, I really don't know, <laughs> you know? Rob cuts the records at his house, which is a few miles from the shop. So while he heads over there, I'm gonna have a cup of coffee. So someone will give me a CD, uh, maybe like WAV format, you know, on a, on a burnt CD. So I'll put that into like my input source, which is basically just like a, like a CD reader. Each disc is heated up to about 100 degrees, which allows the machine to cut grooves directly oh, so into it. And then once it goes down on the record and as I'm cutting it, I actually have like a, like a, a, a tone arm that I use to monitor it with about a one second delay as I'm cutting it. Rob doesn't do orders by the thousands. Typically the most he'll do is about 50 records, but he'll even do just one if that's what you want. So unlock it and spin it back up. That is your side A cut. The records are cut in real time, so that wicked six minute drum solo takes six minutes to put on a record. There's no, there's no like, speeding up of that process. Prices vary depending on how many records you order, but if you want one seven inch, it'll cost you about 15 bucks. If they want that like, like mixed tape, you know, on a record, we get a lot of that, like as a gift. Rob also works with a lot of bands, especially those that don't want to buy a thousand records, but they might want a few dozen. So it's more cost effective for them to be able to do that. So this is the actual record that Rob cut for me. Here, take a listen. Pretty cool, huh? For Orlando My Way, I'm John Busdecker.